it's Swift Game. Welcome back to Stardew Valley. And it is the first day of fall, which means we need to move our little patooties. We got a lot of work to do around here. We have so many things to plant. Uh, dear Swift Key, I was conducting a field study the other day and I found this specimen. I hope you find it as interesting as I did. Oh, it's a Nautilus. Perfect. Thanks, Demetrius. So yeah, we got a lot of stuff to do. So let's get moving. We need to hoe up the ground and do all kinds of things. So uh, we also need to go get our watering can from Clint because he has it and we need it. So let's just start, the shops aren't open yet. So let's just start actually hoeing the ground. We also need to decide what we're going to grow. Um, as you can see, we do have some corn already, which is nice, but we do need to fill it back up. There are some empty spots. I definitely wanna grow a lot of pumpkins. Pumpkins actually make quite a bit of moolah. So we want to do that. And I need five, is it five? Yeah, I need five gold pumpkins for the community center. So we are rolling in grass, which is great. Um, we also need to run over and lay our chickens outside or they're going to get very angry because I don't know if they actually have food in their coop because I haven't played this game in a while. All right, let's quickly run over. You can see that the farm is a little mess messy again. We got some bits of wood around and stuff, but that won't take us too long to clean up. Our grass is growing nicely for the chickens, which is good. We got some eggs. Hi, babies. Oh, I love you so much. You're so cute. All right. And let's open that up so they can come outside and let's pop these eggs down in the mayonnaise makers so we can make some money all right so we have to be careful here we don't want to like accidentally hoe up our already growing corn because we all know what happened last time i got a little too uh pickaxe happy and we lost some of our corn as you can see some of it's growing back yeah that was totally me oops uh, we also need to get some fertilizer down. Uh, can I make sprinklers yet? That's a very important question that I need to answer. I can, but I do not have gold bars. So sprinklers are not going to be a thing until next year, I don't think. Because I got to do a lot more mining. And I'll probably do a lot of mining over the winter. Um, so we're going to leave this spot open. So that... We can, if we eventually get kegs, that's where they'll go. Okay, we need to get rid of this rock. Okay, so the the stores are open, so let's quickly. Oh, I didn't refill my jelly thingies. Tis tisk, tis tis swifty. Need to be more on top of things. Sorry, I'm always like super manic for the first couple of days of the season because I'm just like, gotta get everything planted, gotta get everything planted, gotta get everything ready. So I'm just constantly like. <sighs> Like trying to get everything ready. It's a very stressful time of year, okay? <laughs> Hi, Pierre. I need seeds. Yes, please and thank you. Okay, so our plots are six by three, so that means 18. So we'll probably have at least two things of pumpkins. I might go three. We'll see. They're very expensive. Uh, oh, crap. I forgot how many corn I need. I think I need six on one side and 12 on the other. So 18, I guess. We'll go with that and hope that's right. Uh, we'll get some eggplant. Uh, bok choy, yams. Cranberries are great. I definitely want to grow some cranberries. Oh my gosh, I have so many. Uh, why are cranberry seeds so expensive? Oh, because they grow all season. That's why. I guarantee you that is why. You only need to plant them once, wherever most other things you... Though I think you only need to plant, plant eggplants once, right? Yeah, it continues to produce after first harvest. Yams take 10 days. Bok choy takes four. Uh, we probably won't bother bo with bok choy, because um, it only takes four, four days, so I'm... Mean, uh, we definitely want to get some fairy seeds to plant in front of um, our bee houses. Two, three, four, five, six, so eight of those. There we go. Uh, amaranth takes seven days to grow. Grapes take ten days. Oh my gosh, why are there so many things? Actually, you know what? Let's check what we need for the bundle in the community center because that's kind of important. 
Corn, eggplant, pumpkin, and yams. Okay, so we are, we are definitely going to need a, a thing of yams. So let's go ahead and get those. Oh my gosh, goodbye sweet money. Hardly knew ye. So how many spots do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And two of them are filled up with corn. So I have seven. So if we have two pumpkin, one eggplant, one cranberry, one yam... That leaves us with two empty ones, is that right? Two corn, two pumpkin, eggplant, cranberry, yam. Yeah, so we have two more we can fill. Uh, do we want to get another cranberry? Cranberries are really good when you get kegs because you can make wine out of them. But wheat is also good in that you can make pale ale out of it. Should probably also get some sunflower seeds because you get seeds every time you harvest it. We'll get three of those. Um, hmm. da, 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 da. We'll get another thing of cranberries. Oh my gosh, my poor money. My poor money reserves. And we'll do one of wheat because it's cheap. Okay, I think that's all we need in the way of seeds, and I bought a bunch of fertilizer the other day, I'm pretty sure, so let's head down and grab our water can from Clint. Hey Alex, how's it going honey? Sure, it's getting colder, but still warm enough for sports. That's all I care about. <laughs> you don't say, I'm shocked. Alright, I'd also like to point out that I love my little like turquoise colored shoes, I think they're the cutest. Loving it. I also have some geodes for Clint as well that I'll probably get him to crack open. Yeah, copper watering can. Perfect. Uh, can you process this geode for me? Many thanks. Iron ore, perfect. I can definitely use that. All right, back, 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 back. We gotta keep hoeing and we gotta, yeah, we gotta keep hoeing. <laughs> yeah, bad hoe jokes still continue. Never get old. Never, ever, ever. <laughs> uh, we gotta get hoeing up the ground, and we got to get the fertilizer down, and we gotta get the seeds down, and then we gotta water everything. Hi, am you? Um, are you doing okay? I, I am. I'm a little stressed out right now, but you know that's fine. That's fine. We can do it. There's still plenty of time left in the day think I can make a few field snacks if I start feeling tired. We got this. We got like 13 hours until midnight. <laughs> we can do this. We can do this. We're gonna make this work. Uh, that is not what I want to do. Okay, let's fix this. All right, and let's grab our fertilizer. Where did I put the damn fertilizer? Let's put the Nautilus in there. Why is there stone in here? That's kind of random. Stone, clay, iron ore. I thought I bought fertilizer, did I not? Damn it! <laughs> oh no, I wouldn't, because I have sap, so I can make it. All right, so how many do I need? 18 times nine. I'm great at math. I'm totally calculating this in my head right now. 162. <laughs> yeah, I totally figured that out in my head and didn't use the calculator on my phone. What are you talking about? I appreciate your allegations. All right. I'm not good at mental math, okay? I used to be. When I was in, like, elementary school and junior high school, I was really good at mental math because they made you do it back then. Like, I remember actually having to, like, study and have quizzes where you had to figure out mental math and, like, learning strategies on how to do it. Yeah, they don't really do that anymore that I'm aware of. And, obviously, I haven't used it since forever. So I quickly lost those skills. 162. <laughs> Goodbye, sweet sap. Oh my god, I'm, like, completely out of sap. <laughs> I need to start cutting down more trees. All right, let's get back to hoeing. We got shit to do. At least I'm getting some clay, which is good. I need to start upgrading my hoe next. Everybody needs an upgraded hoe. 
get them special features, you know what I mean? <laughs> Nobody knows what I mean, it's fine. <laughs> I'm sorry, this is very repetitive work, okay? Ah, oh, crap, I didn't buy enough corn. I'm gonna have to go back to Piers. God damn it. <laughs> I was one row short, or one column short, I should I should say. Blech, can't talk. Ah, there we go. You need to work on your aim, Swift Key, Jesus. All right, all right, all right. We got this, we got this. Let's get these freaking crops down. All right, where is me fertilizer? Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Get this fertilizer down so we can get higher quality crops. Oh, actually, we don't need 162 because, yeah, some of our corn is already growing. Oh, well, we'll have some extra left over. That's cool. So, let's see what we got here. Oh, I bought a shit ton of corn. Why did I buy that much corn? Okay, I guess we'll have extra. That's cool. All right, and the yams and the wheat. Okay, so I think I'm gonna put the pumpkins here and here up top, uh, and then have the yams, or the wheat and the yams. And then I'll have my two corns, my two cranberries, and my eggplant down here. So like all of my stuff that continues to grow is kind of down in this corner and everything else is up here. So I think that's the plan I'm gonna go with. Oh well, at least I have enough corn that I don't have to go back to Piers. That makes my life a little easier. Let's get these seeds down. All right, pumpkins. You better grow nice and strong, or I'm gonna be real pissed. Because I need gold pumpkins, my friends. Apparently if you pickle the pumpkins, they're worth quite a bit, which is nice. Yeah, no, we have a ton of extra corn. That's cool. You don't mind that. We'll have it for next season. I need to build another chest too. We're getting a little low on storage space. Alright, eggplant. Aw, the seeds are purple. That's so cute. Are eggplant seeds actually purple? I have no idea. I don't usually cook with eggplant, so... Eggplant can be good if it's done right. I don't have the patience to do it right. It needs to be, like, marinated properly for it to be really good, in my opinion. And I don't have the patience to do that, but I do enjoy eggplant, like when I order it at restaurants and stuff when it's done properly. But the problem is, is if you don't do it properly, it ends up really slimy, so you got to be careful. Oh yeah, look at that. I can now water three things at a time. So awesome. I am a fan of this. Now we water forever. For realsies this time. Oh my gosh. This is gonna suck so hard. I didn't think this through. Why did I plant so much? <laughs> uh, my mornings are going to be so long. Holy crap, it's five o'clock already. God damn it. I swear, there's never enough time in the first day of the season. Uh, excuse you, you were not pointing the right way. There we go. That's how we do it, Missy. Oh, come on. Starting to feel exhausted. Yeah, well, I suggest you suck it up, my dear. Do you have any food you can eat? I 
add some cave carrots. Let's have those. Uh, oh, no. I didn't want to do that. Yes. 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 Hopefully that's enough energy to get the rest of the watering done. If not, I'll make some field snacks. It's not a huge deal. Oh, get the watering can back out. Oh my gosh, sprinklers. I need to make you part of my life. Oh, it's getting dark and I'm out of water. Crap. We may not get the flowers painted or painted, planted today but that's not the end of the world it's just it's nice to have like rare flowers near your bee houses because it actually affects the type of honey they make so they make higher quality more more expensive honey if they have like nice flowers around them but it's not a huge priority because i only have one bee house right now so oh come on stop pointing the wrong oh for god's sake woman we don't have time for this Learn to water, honestly. I think you'd be really good at it now. We do it so much. Yes, I know it's my fault because I'm not clicking in the right spot, but shush. <laughs> Let me get ir irrationally angry. That's not what video games are all about. Uh, I am no stranger to salt and rage. I'll let you know that much. If any of you have watched my Never Alone series, you're, you're well aware of that. Puzzle platformers make me rage like no tomorrow. Just have a lot of feelings, okay? Especially when things aren't working the way I want them to. Oh my. So yeah, this was an exciting day. <laughs> you guys basically just watched me do shit around the farm. Okay, let's make some field snacks, cause uh, you are feeling pretty lackluster there, my dear, and we still got work to do, so. I suggest you suck it up, my love energy does that give me 44 not not too shab all right we'll just eat the two hopefully that's enough to get us through the rest of this i would like to get the flowers done but we will we shall see i also gotta shut the chickens in all right oh my gosh we're gonna have so much money once this stuff starts to ripen it's all worth it in the end I do have a bee house, right? I'm pretty sure I made one. All right, all that's done. Yes, I did. Okay, let's clear this area. And we'll put some flowers here. All right, and we'll probably put the flowers like... Actually, let's put the flowers like, yeah, right here. And we've got our one sprinkler. Let's put it in the middle of the flowers because I'll definitely forget to water the damn flowers like all the time. So uh, I don't really care about the quality of these, so I'm not going to bother to put fertilizer down. They're just flowers. All right. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's 9.30. We still got time. It's just very dark. I need to make some like lights to go around the property. <laughs> All right, we have one sprinkler, so let's go get that. Haul that out and stick that in the middle of the flowers. There we go, perfection. Let's pop over and lock our chickens in and grab the mayonnaise. We're doing okay, we're doing okay. We got this. In you go, chickies. And let's grab this mayonnaise, we shall sell it. Oh my gosh. Well, that was an insane day, but well worth it. Let's pop the corn seeds in here. Oh yeah, I still got those sunflowers too. I should probably, um, should probably plant those. I'll stick the field. Oh no, I need my hoe. Need my hoe. Let's sell the, that mayonnaise. I need to put things in. Uh, let's put the sunflowers down here, I guess since I don't have kegs right now. Meek, are you sleeping down in the crops, you weirdo? I mean, whatever floats your boat, kitty, but there we go. All right, so we did get everything planted. I am so pleased with myself right now because I really didn't expect that to happen. All right, what do we got here? Um, 
let's pickle some hot peppers, I guess. And then we need to go to bed, because holy crap, what a day. We actually still have some energy left over, too. Thank you, Field Snacks. All right, well, that was a productive first day of fall. Yes, go to sleep. I didn't make any money, but... 300 gold, wow, that's sad. And we spent, like, what, over 10,000 in seeds? So depressing. All right, so what's going on for today? It's gonna be cloudy tomorrow. And spirits are very happy today. That's good to hear. Yay, things are starting to sprout already. Excitement. All right. So let's get watering. Story of our lives for the next 28 days. Thank God I upgraded the watering can. That was a stroke of genius on my part. Can you, can you imagine if I couldn't do three at a time? Oh my gosh, we'd be here all day. We'd like finish working on the farm at like five o'clock PM every day, which I'm guessing is more like real farm life. Like I'm pretty sure farming is like 14 hour days in real life. Meanwhile, I'm like, ugh, it takes me like three hours to water all my crops. Wah, 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 wah. Then I don't have time to go fishing. My life is so hard. First of all, farming problems. I just, I don't know. I find it hard trying to like keep up banter while I'm just watering for hours on end. <laughs> I run out of things to talk about. Our corn hasn't sprouted, which is kind of odd. I guess it takes longer. Oh, some of our corn is ready and I just grabbed it. Look at that. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and collect that. You know, I'm cool with it. Means we'll actually make some money today, which is nice. Oh, you're gonna do it that way, okay? Ah, stop it! Turn this way. There we go. Honestly. Ruining up my... You're ruining up my pattern here, Missy. Oh, out of water. I think the capacity of your watering can increases when you upgrade it too, like it holds more water, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Feel free to correct me if you know better. All right, getting there, getting there, over halfway. Just gonna be watering forever. So yeah, now that I've got everything planted, today will be less frantic if I learn how to water properly. Christ, come on girl. Oh my gosh, stop it. There we go. Keep clicking like too close to her feet so she turns. That gets even more annoying when you get cows and you're trying to milk them and she refuses to turn the right way. Oh my gosh, that's so like rage inducing. Should try and see if we can make another bee house too, if we end up getting more maple syrup from our taps. I'd honestly like to plant more, like I know you can plant grapes and stuff, but I like, I don't think I can do it cause I'm just, I'll run out of time. for watering because I'll just like and I don't think you guys want to watch me water for like most of the day every day I also need to go let the chickens out or they're gonna be pissed at me all right everything's watered so yeah it takes me four out in game hours to water all my crops so I definitely don't want to get more crops because I'll just be watering forever and ever hi babies give me them eggs everybody looks fine right everybody's looking good all right, come out, my lovelies. I know you like to be outside. Let's make some mayo. I'm actually going to clear some of this grass away. So I can get to my mayonnaise makers with little to no issue. So let's clean up around the farm a bit today because it's a bit messy. This always happens when the seasons change. Uh, it always just kind of makes your farm a bit of a mess again. Not nearly as bad as it was, you know, the first time you stepped onto the farm but it does make things a little messy, which annoys me. Cause then I gotta go around and clean everything up. 
I'm actually gonna leave that tree there. I think it's kind of cute. If it starts to bug me, I can always chop it down. I do need to chop down some trees because uh, none of my tappers have anything, huh? Because I am low on sap because I've made so much fertilizer. Let's clear all this grass out of here because it's just kind of in the way. I will eventually get a second silo. Oh, I should check my mushrooms too. I don't think I've done that in a while. Any mushrooms? Oh my gosh, look at all these mushrooms. I wonder how often they're ready. Sweet. So I think I already put a moral in the exotic foraging bundle. I did, okay. I already put a moral into the community center so I can sell this one. We'll sell the starred stuff and the mushrooms, so we'll keep everything else. Nope, nope, wrong, wrong box. I think we need another chest. What do we need to make a chest? Just wood, perfect. That I have. All right, bam, got a third chest. All right, let's cut down some trees. Oh, yeah, my chickens are outside. I was just about to say, what? My chickens aren't outside? That's weird. Okay. Oh, got an acorn. Yeah, I usually spend like the first few days of the season just hanging out on my farm. I do go into town to get seeds and stuff, but I usually stick pretty close to home. Because I'm just trying to like get everything set up for the coming season. Oh, my mayonnaise ready. Sweet. I'm starting to feel exhausted already. God, Swiftkey, you're such a wuss. Oh, pff, that's not what I wanted to do. Manny's machine, go back where I put you. All right, so since I'm feeling exhausted, I do have a field snack, so let me go grab that. I will take that, 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 that can go in there. Yes, so you don't die of exhaustion, you fucking wuss. All right, uh, mayonnaise, off you go. Let's go into town and see Alex and maybe Elliot. Uh, we need to pick up forageable things to put into the community center so we'll do that too oh hi abby what are you doing hanging out here i try to help out the shop on most days business has been pretty bad since the jojo mart opened though yeah boo boo jojo mart how dare you ruin small businesses that's why i always shop at peers i should actually check peers and see if he's got any uh carpet or uh flooring sorry also, is it anyone's birthday today? Oh, it's Penny's birthday. Oh, I don't have any flowers to give her. I would like a cute girl to bring me a sardine, winky face, Sam. Uh, okay, Sam. You know what? You're a cutie patoot. I will. Is Alex around? Oh, got a cutscene. This is our third cutscene with Alex, I believe. Second or third? Sigh. Oh, hey, Swiftkey. Question mark. Embarrassed drop. Look at all these books. I haven't read a single one. Just the thought of cracking one open makes me nervous. But you can't make a decent living in this world without a brain. I'm worthless. Oh, Alex. Oh, poor baby. I feel so bad for him. That he's like, I, cause like, Sometimes, a lot of times, the people who seem the most confident are actually the most insecure. So I can totally get where he's coming from. Like, a lot of people who seem like they're totally self-assured and totally, like, dickheads who are like, yeah, I'm the best thing ever, are actually super insecure. And it makes me so sad that he's insecure about his intelligence. Oh, I know you're a jock, but that doesn't mean you're stupid, honey. 
So that's crazy, you're a genius. We all have our strengths and weaknesses or worthless. Yeah, that about sums it up. Oh my gosh, that's so mean. Okay, I don't wanna say that's crazy, you're a genius because again, you don't wanna be like, no, you're a super genius. Like that sounds super patronizing. So I think I'm gonna go with we all have our strengths and weaknesses because that's very much true. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, exclamation point. Well, I'm not gonna give up. That's the attitude to have, Alex. If I work hard, I can do anything. Yeah. Hey, maybe one day soon we'll have dinner and discuss philosophy. Isn't that what you smart people talk about? <laughs> Me laughing. <laughs> like, excuse you, what? <laughs> Aw, sweet little baby Alex. You've stolen my heart, sir. I think you might be the one for me. Ugh, can't talk. Too busy doing cleaning presses. <laughs> Alright, uh, I can't remember how you felt about blueberries. I still need to learn how to make sashimi. Oh, you're getting a blueberry. Thanks. No problem. So, yeah. So, how many hearts do we have with him now? Five. Okay. Uh, let's drop into Piers and see what he's got in the way of house decorations. Hey, Lewis. It was around this time of year when I first became mayor. Over 20 years ago. Crazy. That makes me feel really old. <laughs> Poor Lewis. Alright, what you got in the way of flooring? Uh, I don't think I have either of those, so I'm gonna take them. Because, you know, I have tons of, like spare income right now i really don't <laughs> let's see if gus has the recipe for sashimi oh another cutscene my god cutscene city here hi i'll take your order in a few moments uh is this cutscene with him or oh it's with elliot ah Oh no, he must have heard what I said about Alex, and he was like, excuse you, I'm gonna have a cutscene with you too. Think you can get away from me that easily? Oh no, the love triangle. <laughs> so much dramas. Hello, Swiftkey, what a pleasant surprise. I was just stopping in to relax after an eight hour writing session. Bartender, fetch me your finest ale and bring some wine for the lady. Da, 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 grumpy face. <laughs> I actually would rather have the ale too, but you know what? If you're buying, I'm not going to complain. <laughs> I'm more of a beer drinker than I am a wine drinker, which is unusual for lady, I know, but I, I much prefer beer. I don't like wine. Never have. There you go, sir. Wait, I propose a toast to to Pelican Town, to our friendship, to my good health, or to your due. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so tempted to pick the last one. Uh, I don't want to say to my good health because that's really self-centered. I'm going to say to our friendship. That's a great idea. Here's to us. Jeez, Swift Key, slow her down there. Pick strong stuff. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, Elliot, you're a cutie patoot too. Oh no, now I'm conflicted again. God damn it, guys. Oh geez, I'm still drunk. What's the tipsy? Minus one speed. Uh, you got anything I can buy recipe wise? Tortilla recipe, hash browns recipe, pizza recipe. Oh, they're so expensive, and there's no sashimi recipe. God damn it. Alright. Uh, how long does this last? <laughs> okay, it's almost over now. Uh, beach is a cool place to hang out and soak up some rays. You gotta spend some time in the sun, or else you'll get all pale. Hey, do you want to hang out with me at the beach sometime? Do you have a bikini? Oh, Alex. Really? <laughs> You horn dog. If you're not checking out my ass and my pants, you're asking if I got a bikini. Where's Penny? Is she hanging out down here? It's her birthday, so I kind of want to give her something. Oh, there she is. 
Hey, Pen. Oh, no, that's Jazz. No, that's Jazz. I want to talk to Penny. I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Well, uh, you know what? Happy birthday. Have a blueberry. Oh, a birthday gift. Thank you. Yay, now I have two hearts with, Pen with Penny. That's good. Uh, Sam wanted me to catch a sardine, right? Oh, I see a blackberry. Perfect. So I got two things for the bun the forging bundle. Oh, geez, there's all kinds of stuff here, too. Perfect. All right, let's go see if we can catch a sardine for Sam. Hey, Willie. How's it going? A true angler has respect for the water. Don't you forget that. Sure. Wise words. Okay, I still got bait, which is good. Sea cucumber. Wah wah. Ye sardine, come on. Getting sloppy. Another sea cucumber. God damn it. <laughs> All those times I caught sardines and I didn't want them. And now I can't freaking catch one. Figures. Whoa. I think you are probably not a sea cucumber. You're definitely moving more than one. Oh my gosh. Why did I get so bad at fishing? Oh my gosh, stop it. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Hold still. Good fish. Oh, that's an albacore. That's new. It's not the fish I need, though. I think albacore is a kind of tuna, right? Don't tuna grow, like, huge, though? God damn it, another one. I mean, I guess it's good. There is an achievement for catching all the different types of fish, so... I'm broadening my horizons, I guess. I'm gonna head home soon. I think this video is getting a bit too long. If this isn't a sardine, I'll just head home. Or, you know, I could totally fail at catching it. It's also a possibility. Gosh, stop it. Another albacore. All right, let's head back. I'm gonna shut my, chi my, my chickens in and stuff, so. Actually, let's pop up to the community center real quick and drop off those two forge things. Uh, is anybody around? If nobody's around, I can check the trash cans. Oh, got a pine cone. Yay. Awesome. Oh, got another great or, uh, blackberry. Perfect. And another one. And another one. My gosh, there's blackberries everywhere. Oh, no, we don't want to fish the blackberry. We just want to pick it up. There we go. All right. And the forge stuff is in the craft room, right? Yes. Fall. Oh, it's a construction bundle. Okay. Oh, I have one of those mushrooms. So I still need a hazelnut. All right. a fairly productive t day. We got some stuff to sell, so I think we entered nothing gained. 
got two cutscenes with our two suitors. <laughs> oh, the romantic triangle. I'm all, t I'm all go, I'm all conflicted again now. I was set on Alex for the, for a moment there, and then it was like, no, can't decide. All right, we'll keep the pine cone because we use that to grow trees, and also make field snacks. All right, well, let's head to bed because our energy is pretty low. Oh, we got to shut the chickens in. Can't forget to do that. If you do that, like, if you let them wander around in the morning, sometimes you don't get eggs from them, which can be kind of annoying. So shut them in. And then run on back and go to bed. Yeah, I definitely need to get some lights out here. Should have made some money today because we did collect some corn. Oh, we did. Perfect. All right. Well, I'm going to end this video here. Sorry it was a bit longer than normal, but that always happens at the beginning of the season because you have to do so much for the first couple of days. But uh, I think we're, we're set up pretty well for fall. I think we'll make some good money with all the crops we got going. So if you guys did enjoy this video and you like this series, please press the like and subscribe buttons. I really do appreciate all of your support. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a great day. Thank you.